The Coast Guard launched its first domestically built 4,000-ton patrol vessel on Tuesday. President Tsai Ing-wen attended the ceremony in Kaohsiung and gave the ship the name of Jiayi after the county. This massive frigate can be used in both war and peace. In peacetime, it can serve as a state-of-the-art medical support vessel. In a battle scenario, it can be equipped with projectile launchers and remote control weapons. Tsai said that the ship would significantly bolster Taiwan's maritime defense capabilities. President Tsai attended the launch of Taiwan's first domestically produced 4,000-ton patrol cutter on Tuesday. The Coast Guard ship was christened Jiayi. I'm delighted to have the honor today. It's my hope that everything goes smoothly for you as you sail the seven seas. I, Tsai Ing-wen, hereby christen you Jiayi. It's the largest patrol ship in Taiwan, and it was christened Jiayi in honor of the central county, the biggest fish producer in the area. It's 125 meters long, 16.5 meters wide, and can travel for 10,000 nautical miles before having to return to port. It can be used in both peace and war. In a battle scenario, the vessel can be equipped with Zhenhai rocket projectiles and remote weapon systems. It also has space for helicopter landings during wartime. In times of peace, the ship can serve as a medical support ship with negative pressure isolation wards, operating rooms and wards for patients with hypothermia. Its developers said the ship would excel in a wide array of situations. Since I took office, I have proactively pushed for indigenous shipbuilding. I've extended my full support to the plans to develop our Coast Guard fleet. Making newer and faster Coast Guard vessels provides a greater guarantee of safety for our brothers and sisters on duty at sea. Our plan is to produce one ship every two years. Later, we'll try to deliver ahead of schedule. We estimate we'll be able to produce and hand over four 4,000-ton ships in five years. The Coast Guard is looking to add 141 vessels in 10 years, with a combined tonnage of 33,000 tons. The project is expected to create more than 1,000 job opportunities while considerably boosting Taiwan's naval defense.